All right, this is our cute little male chinchilla. And when I say male, this guy can brag. Anyway, um, <laughs> mom's just not her head, yes. Because she's seen so many chinchillas. <laughs> because I'm videotaping, she's not going to say a word. All right, that's cool. I can take it. Um, this guy's actually pretty emaciated. You cannot tell, but you can actually feel his ribs here. And, and he's like, what are you doing? What are you doing to me? All right, yeah, scratch right there. That's a good spot. All right, good news is his dentition is fine. His teeth look good. Um, he's just underweight from not being able to absorb much nutrition past this yeast infection he's got. We're going to send him home with some nystatin, a very, very safe antifungal. Uh, I always say that if uh, nystatin is one of the few medications I have in this building that I could drink a gallon of and it wouldn't cause any problems except for a lot of yellow poop. Um, other than that, it's actually quite safe. So we're going to put him on a two weeks into that. We're going to recheck his fecal in two weeks. Okay, if you are nervous any time between now and then you want to bring him in, we'll be glad to recheck him even sooner. Okay, um, other than that, so far so good. We're going to start him on his treatment, and hopefully mom will have a uh, mini, mini gram heavier guinea pig, me <laughs> chinchilla. That was my fault, sorry. Cut! Later. All right, this is a figo from my chinchilla, who's uh, pretty underweight, pretty emaciated. Getting a body score of about uh, two out of five. And we have on this fecal tons and tons of megabacteria, and that's those little oval to oblong shapes. They're actually a fungus who called them megabacteria beyond me, but that's what I was taught in school. Anyway, um, we put this guy on some very safe antifungals for a while, and chances are we'll get rid of these, and this guy will actually gain some weight. Life should be good.